love burning books. Drunk Literature Season 4, which is basically just books Cassie has read. Woo! <laughs> but zero Celsius is 31 Fahrenheit, so like... It is closer together. Yeah. Yeah, like 30 Celsius is like 100. So it'd have to burn higher if it was in Fahrenheit. So that's like a super high temperature. Well, I mean, think about We're it. We're talking I, about not just burning, but, like, combustion, like, like spontaneously. Incinerating. Like, so you can cook roasts at, like, well, not roasts, but you can cook things in the oven at, like, 450 degrees Fahrenheit, and, like, the parchment paper will curl up and get a little bit brown. That's fair. But it won't just combust. spontaneously combust, yeah. But more, more importantly, you guys, educated people, should probably clear anything about saving books, but I thought it was hilarious that we're reading a book about burning books to burn that book. Okay, who here remembers enough about the book to give a plot summary? Oh, nope. Not, not me. Definitely not. Claire! You? I was just saying I finished my fourth drink, but okay, <laughs> let's see how this goes. I literally could not give a plot summary of Harry Potter last season. <laughs> that is true. Alright, so a dude is in an unhappy marriage. He works What's for he something important. I think he's a firefighter. Sure. His wife likes TV a whole butt ton. Like, that's all she does. But she does karaoke on the TV, doesn't she? Sure. But I think firefighters in this dystopian universe are the guys who set fire to books. Yeah, 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 yeah. I agree with you. I think firefighters have an alternative hope. But he got really obsessed with the book and went against the government, which, like, say. He was a firefighter. Boom. His wife overdosed. His neighbors Boom. were the crazy, like the the um, idealistic looking to <coughs> the fact that he was miserable. His wife was overdosing. She was secretly miserable too. His neighbors were like idealistic people, and he always questioned them. But then this one woman was so passionate about her books, she burned to death with her books, and he saved one of her books. Does anyone remember anything? Well, Not really, other than that I liked the man. Katrina? Yeah. Oh, I was just going to say, all my books caught on fire once, and I did not stay with them. <laughs> I just let them burn and left the house, because I am not that into literature. Like, I'm pretty into literature, not that into literature. <laughs> well, I did you like it, though, because I know. the world was Thank such you. a mess, though, and he did, he did, like... He was miserable, and he realized it, and I think that takes a lot of courage to realize that maybe the answer to your misery is sometimes Can beyond your mental capability, which might be something you learn about through words, but words blow. <laughs> I do agree with her in the sense that words blow. 